Have you ever wondered how Himalayan salt is mined? This unique pink salt has fascinated many with its origins and mining process. There's a captivating tale behind the allure of this distinctive mineral. Let's embark on an exploration of the Himalayan salt, a treat that has not just invigorated our taste buds but has also piqued our curiosity. Himalayan salt, often recognized for its striking pink hue, is more than just a colorful addition to your dinner table. Harvested from the heart of the Himalayas, this salt is believed to be over 250 million years old. Its distinctive color is attributed to the trace minerals it contains, including iron, potassium, and magnesium. In recent years, Himalayan salt has garnered a lot of attention. It's not just chefs and food connoisseurs who rave about it, but also health enthusiasts who appreciate its purported health benefits. Some claim that it can help balance the body's pH, improve hydration, and even support respiratory function. But where does this magical mineral come from? The answer lies within the Kara salt mine in Pakistan, the world's second largest salt mine. This monumental mine is often referred to as the Salt Range, stretching over an area of more than 110 square miles. It's a marvel of nature, a testament to the Earth's vibrant past, and the primary source of the world's Himalayan salt. The Kara salt mine has been in operation for centuries, a silent witness to the passage of time. Its labyrinthine tunnels and chambers are a testament to the labor of countless miners who have tirelessly extracted this precious mineral, grain by grain, to bring it to our kitchens. The story of Himalayan salt is a tale of nature's majesty, human ingenuity, and the relentless pursuit of quality. It's a journey that begins millions of years ago, in the depths of the ancient seas, and continues today in the heart of the majestic Himalayas. Stay tuned as we delve deeper into the intriguing process of Himalayan salt mining. To understand the mining process we must first journey into the heart of the Himalayas. Imagine a vast, majestic mountain range, spanning five countries and holding some of the world's highest peaks. This is the Himalayan region, a place of immense beauty and geographical significance. One place of distinct interest within this range is the Kara Salt Mine. Nestled in the foothills of the Salt Range Hill System in the Punjab province of Pakistan, Kara is the world's oldest and second largest salt mine. Its history is as rich as the mineral it produces. The mine's discovery can be traced back to around 300 BC, during the expeditions of Alexander the Great. Legend has it that his army's horses were seen licking the salty rocks thus unveiling the hidden treasure beneath. The significance of Kara extends far beyond its age, it's a testament to human ingenuity, a symbol of cultural heritage and a vital economic resource. The mine has yielded tons of salt over the centuries, shaping economies and influencing cuisines around the world. Moreover, Kara is not just a mine but a subterranean wonderland with structures, chambers and even a mosque all carved from salt. Mining Himalayan salt is not merely an industrial process, it's a tradition, passed down through generations, a dance between man and nature that has remained relatively unchanged for centuries. The methods used today are a blend of age-old techniques and modern technology, a testament to the resilience and adaptability of the human spirit. The salt from Kara is distinct, its pink hue a result of iron oxide or rust within the salt. This color, along with its rich mineral content, has made Himalayan salt a sought-after commodity in the global market, used not only for culinary purposes but also in spa treatments and various health and wellness products. Now that we've set the stage, it's time to explore the actual process of mining Himalayan salt. As we delve deeper into the heart of the Himalayas, we'll uncover the steps that take this mineral from a rocky deposit to a kitchen counter across the globe. So, stay tuned as we embark on this fascinating journey. Mining Himalayan salt is a meticulous process requiring both precision and patience. It's a dance between man and nature, carefully orchestrated to preserve the purity of this ancient mineral treasure. The process begins with the miners descending into the depths of the Himalayan mountains. They're not just miners, they're custodians of a tradition passed down through generations. The salt extraction process is steeped in simplicity, a testament to the traditional methods that have been used for centuries. The miners work in harmony with the environment, using simple tools such as pickaxes and shovels, rather than heavy machinery. This is not a race against time but a deliberate, respectful interaction with the mountain. Each strike of the pickaxe is measured, each movement calculated, to ensure the salt remains as natural and unadulterated as possible. In this intricate ballet, the miners extract large blocks of salt, each one unique, with its own pattern of colors ranging from white to deep pink. These blocks, each weighing up to several hundred pounds, 
are then carefully transported out of the mine. It's a strenuous task, but the miners undertake it with a sense of pride and dedication, knowing that they're part of a process that brings health benefits to millions around the world. Safety is paramount in these mines. Despite the traditional methods, modern safety measures are in place to protect the miners. Helmets, safety glasses, and protective clothing are standard. The mines are regularly inspected for structural stability, ensuring the safety of the miners and the integrity of the salt. This delicate balance between tradition and safety between man and mountain results in the extraction of one of the purest salts on earth. It's a process that respects the salt's natural state, maintaining its rich mineral content and unique taste. Mining is just the first step. The next stage is the transformation of these rough salt blocks, but that's a story for another time. For now, let's marvel at the art of mining, a testament to human resilience and the respect for nature's bounty. Once the salt blocks are extracted, the refining process begins. The raw salt, still carrying traces of the mine, is first transported to a nearby facility. Here it is meticulously cleaned to remove any impurities. This process is done by hand, ensuring that each block of salt is treated with the utmost care. Once cleaned, the blocks are then subjected to a crushing process. This step is crucial in determining the final product. Some blocks are crushed into large granules perfect for use in salt grinders. Others are ground down to a fine powder, ideal for use in cooking and baking. In some cases the salt is even crushed into a coarse powder, making it a perfect addition to bath products like scrubs and soaks. Next comes packaging. The salt is carefully weighed and sealed into bags ready for distribution. You might think that's where the story ends but in fact, that's just the beginning. Himalayan salt has a myriad of uses that extend far beyond the kitchen. In the culinary world, it is celebrated for its unique flavor and mineral-rich composition. Chefs around the globe use it to enhance the flavors of their dishes, from savory steaks to sweet desserts. But the uses of Himalayan salt don't stop at the dining table. In the realm of health and wellness it's lauded for its potential benefits. Some believe it can aid in hydration, improve respiratory conditions, and even balance the body's pH levels. Then there's the world of decor, where Himalayan salt takes on a whole new life. Carved into lamps, it emits a warm, inviting glow. Sculpted into serving dishes, it adds a touch of elegance to any table setting. But, regardless of how it's used, each granule of Himalayan salt carries a story. A story of a journey that began deep within the Himalayan mountains, traversed through the hands of skilled miners and artisans, and ended up right here, on your kitchen shelf or in your living room. So, that's the journey of Himalayan salt, from the depths of the Himalayas to your kitchen shelf.